Week 7, Problem 6. A horizontal power line of length, what is that, 60 meters, carries a current of 2 kiloamps northward as shown in the figure below. The Earth's magnetic field at this location has a magnitude of 4.5 times 10 to the negative 5 teslas. The field at this location is directed toward the north at an angle of 65 degrees below the power line. <coughs> Find the magnitude of the magnetic field on the power line. All right, we can do this. So. I'm going to start off by writing our equation that we use pretty much every single time in life. By in life, I mean for this one week. Alright, so we have force, ooh, blue, equals, zoom in a bit more, no, too far, there we go, Q, V, cross B. Alright, so the idea here is if we look at V and we say, well, that's basically just a length per second. And we take the second and we give it to our Q, then we can also say, kind of, sort of, that this is equal to I L cross B. Where instead of having meters per second, we just have meters. And now we've changed our Q to uh, Q per second, i.e. current. Um, little so then uh, the direction of L will be the direction of current so I guess I could really move the L over here and then put the uh, vector on the I but you, you get the idea in the Navy we refer to this um, equation as fire incinerates little bunnies so F for fire I for incineration L for little and the B for bunnies fire incinerates little bunnies just a mnemonic to help you um, under, to remember, not that I'd ever, you know, advocate the incinerating of bunnies, but... Okay, so let's decompose this vector, do a little bit of that, do a little bit of that. Alright, and this will be our magnetic vector. So, now looking at this guy, we have, find the magnitude of the magnetic force on the power line. Alright, so we've got a cross product here. This cross product tells us that we're only going to care about the sine of theta. So what that means is, since I decomposed it into two parallel, not parallel, perpendicular, exact opposite of what I meant to say, the two perpendicular vectors, the vector that, a part, the part of the magnetic field that is parallel to the current will contribute nothing. But the part that is perpendicular will contribute everything. Um, so... <coughs> We're just going to multiply this guy out. Yeah, let's see here. 